dating can be risky. You never know who you're going to fall in love with or where it might lead you. You never know if it will be worth all the worry, stress, and heartbreak, or if you'll get bored. Wouldn't it be nice if there was a trick or a list of traits you could know to never let the one go? Hello everyone, and welcome to the highly successful you. Today, we're going to talk about if a man has these 10 qualities, never let him go. If you've met the perfect guy, you shouldn't let him go. But how do you know you've met the right one? There are clues, but it can be hard to tell. Just because someone has some good traits won't outweigh the bad, will it? These 10 traits are present in the keepers of your life. The kind of men like a strike of lightning in a bottle. The guys you don't just happen across daily. Make sure you watch to the end, because if you're with someone without these 10 traits, you might be wasting your time. If you're excited for today's video, make sure you hit the like button. So with that, let's get right into it. 1. He's kind to everyone. This is a blanket statement. You can't just be kind to people on their best days and expect a prize. You can be kind to some people and expect it to be enough. On your worst days, under the worst circumstances, these men choose kindness, no matter who they're talking to. The waiter who brings them the wrong appetizer, the co-worker who keeps annoying them, his family and yours, even on the most stressful. Pretty much, the default should be to choose kindness and not take his frustration out on anyone else. These men are genuinely kind and spread kindness wherever he goes. 2. He is the only one you think about. Attractiveness can be important in a relationship, no matter where you fall on the spectrum. Do you know the things that turn you on, or what makes you turn your head when someone hot walks into the room? Attractiveness is more than aesthetics or superficial qualities we might find in someone. Your guy should be the person your mind falls back on when daydreaming. If you think about that hot barista at the cafe less and less, and more about the person you're with, well, you found a keeper. 3. He's honest. Honesty is vital, and honesty will help build a better bond between you and your partner. It's good to surround yourself with people you can trust, and honesty goes a long way with that, no matter the relationship. Living with a genuine partner can foster a better communication between you, allowing you to become more comfortable with it. When you feel supported and safe in a relationship, you won't feel like there's anything to hide. Even if there's something to hide, you might begin to doubt them if you don't feel safe and equally shared with them. An honest man will tell you how he is, so you don't doubt his intentions or feelings. Trust will make you value his input more and give you a certainty that other men wouldn't. Never let him go if you found a man you can trust. 4. He doesn't put up with your nonsense. We all have baggage and issues we may not realize we're taking out on other people. Having someone who can keep you responsible on top of things and in line. When you have a partner who understands you well enough to call you on your nonsense or call you when you're getting ridiculous, you know you have a good one. This is a man who knows your patterns and how to talk to you about them. He's got to do it kindly but often these men know how to offer support when and where you need it. Doesn't that sound great? 5. He's a genuinely happy person. There are so few people out there who are genuinely happy, like Sunshine Incarnate. If you've found yourself one of these Sunshine people, you should never let them go. They'll be your sun when you feel gloomy or lift you even higher when you feel good. They'll take joy in your joy or try to make it even better. Find someone who adds to your bucket, not takes from it, because then you'll have more of your own joy to feel and give to others. 6. He enjoys your company. I cannot stress this enough. You should be with someone who enjoys being around you just as much as you do to them. We want someone by our side who can laugh at our jokes, but generally, having a life partner who actively enjoys your company at every turn can make everything more enjoyable. Finding a man who enjoys watching movies with you and seeks you out for company one-on-one -on -one just because, well, you should keep that one around. 7. You can be yourself around him. No matter how much you might be into someone, it'll never really be right unless you can let down your guard. If you're constantly under a heightened stress level, trying to please or appease someone or be something you're not, you will burn yourself out hard and fast. Find someone you can relax around who makes you feel safe even when you're at your most vulnerable, because those are the moments that he's supposed to be your partner too, not just the highlights reel. 8. He's not spiteful. There's nothing worse than a toxic, spiteful person. Many people in the world are like this, ready to hold things against you, no matter if it's a man or woman. You're going to run into many people who will hold your every mistake against you. If you've found a partner willing to forgive you without holding a grudge and allow you to grow and learn from your mistakes, you've found a keeper. If they're constantly harping on you about past mistakes, perceived or actual, they'll always be hanging over you like a haunting scepter you can't escape. This man is a keeper even if he doesn't realize it. He's encouraging you to be a better person in a positive way. It can't get much better than that. 9. The two of you hold similar values. While it's nice when you have someone to challenge you from time to time and offer you a new perspective, Long-lasting relationships are built on a shared belief of values. These are the things we hold nearest and dearest to us and believe in strongly. 
You might really like someone, but it will be impossible to reconcile if your values are inherently different. Just as you want a partner who will not try to make you be a different person, you shouldn't expect it in exchange. There are going to be certain non-negotiables between you and your partners that align when you're trying to set up a life with someone. Otherwise, you'll have a lifetime of fights ahead of you. 10. He accepts you as you are. Everyone has their flaws. People can be too critical of their partner in how they act, how they dress, how much they make, and so much more. This sort of behavior will drag you down, diminishing your self-esteem from within. If someone you love and who's supposed to love you seems to have nothing but negative things to say, you'll have a hard time finding nice things to tell about yourself. Your partner should be someone who doesn't make you feel inferior, not accepted, or not good enough. He's there to help you be your best self, not change you into a new person. Get yourself a man who loves and accepts your flaws as you are, not for who you could be. He'll love the person he met without molding you into something else. Every man is different, just like every relationship. If you found a person you want to spend the rest of your life with, and he feels like a quirky pick or an atypical choice, then more power to you. Unlikely pairs and opposites happen all the time. Those relationships can work. However, if you find yourself on the fence and not sure if you found the one, then try to look at the whole picture and figure out the value this other person is actively bringing to the table. It might be easy to tell if he's the one, but not being sure doesn't mean all is lost. A keeper might not fit every tidy little box, but someone with the abundance of green flags like the ones we've talked about today is definitely worth the effort. And that brings us to the end of today's video. Are there any thoughts you'd like to share? Drop them down in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.